G'day, I'm Clive and welcome to CDP Outdoors. Back down at Four Creek Shelter on the Bilberman track. Another night out testing gear. A lot of people have been through here today. One guy's doing a minimum of uh, triple hut. So, yeah, good on him. Another guy, he's going to do a quad. Uh, too fit for me. There's a chap here, he's just started his end to end again. Uh, his family came down, the children, it was beautiful it was to see them all down here joining in, helping to get the fire going, warming their marshmallows over it and warming up their sausages to have something to eat. And they were loving it. mat again is the is it the sea to summit camp mat si which is self inflating the r value on this one doesn't say but i think it's about the 4.6 4.8 last time i used it i gave it a couple of puffs but it was too hard in the night so i'm just going to put it in now and let it self inflate and see if that's any more comfortable for tonight Let's open the valve and there's a hiss. Yep, while that inflates, I'm going to go and sit by the fire. seven times more right two special people one thinks Very he's not special. <laughs> yeah special in the mind or yeah a bit of both well we got rob here he's just about to finish the ben. Bibbleman uh, ben sorry yeah ben here he's just about to finish a bit and amond as well at the same time both gonna end up in calamunda shortly tomorrow so midday midday straight to the pub there you go straight to the pub yeah yeah and yourself? Yeah, I'm taking it nice and easy. Yeah. Have a nice breakfast at the um, 
wondering where and yeah. I'll take it real slow tomorrow. Are you going to hit, hit the pub in Kalamunda too? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> straight, straight home for a shower. Yeah. So what was the most uh, memorable experience on the bib for you? Um, Pinger up planes were good. Today was good. All the flowers exploded today. And the coastal section was really good. Mm. The rain was unforgettable. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get when you pick to choose to walk in August. So, no, it's all been good. Yeah. No one's uh, hit me over the head or anything in a shoulder. <laughs> Despite a couple of weird experiences, but everyone else has been friendly. Towns have been good. Shoulders are easy. Yeah. So if you're going to do a... Uh, Looking to do a long trail in Australia, this one's not too hard. Good good place to start. Yeah. And yourself? What's um, your favourite bit then? My favourite bit? Well, my most memorable bit would have been the couple of storms that I got around Peaceful Bay. But my favourite bit, um, I really like the beach walking around Denmark, a bit after Denmark, and then um, some of like the longer longer days in the, in the, yeah, the Pinger Up Plains. Nice and flat, good views all around and pretty wet but it was a good challenge and wasn't yeah it wasn't too bad when, when, once I got into there and you was just saying this is your first time yep first on time on a, hiking first time on a long trail yeah I definitely reckon it's a good good place to start love love the shelters and going through towns and breeze supplies pretty straightforward and definitely learn a lot um but yeah having so a great time and so what was your channel that you don't want people to subscribe to, to see your amazing journey? Uh, Darwin on the trail. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, just, uh, what is my, it's just my follow, name. Was it follow the? Follow the Wargle. There you go. Lots of complaining about the rain. <laughs> I don't complain all the time though, but I edit, edited it, the complaining in. That's it. <laughs> Put that in especially. The odd uh, political statement. <laughs> <laughs> the odd beer shot yeah, and some bad uh, camera work <laughs> <laughs> sorry about that <laughs> so where would you recommend to anybody to go for a beer then a beer yeah on this trial uh, yeah the uh, Mumby pub which other pubs have I gone to I don't think I've went into any other pubs I did on the um, when I had the week off Normally just buy a six pack. Yeah. And we've got one other person who's walked the trail before a few times called Ant. So what's your experience of the trail? Well, I'll let you know Ant's just started his end-to-end yeah. -end heading north it's to south. Lazy, lazy day. Yeah, lazy day today. I don't know. I think the trail is like 20 years of therapy in 50 days. It's good for your soul. There you go. Anything else from the last time who's out there that got you? I could I could regale you with my dog story again, but <laughs> that's embarrassing. So, <laughs> <laughs> no, just don't be afraid, man. Get out there and have a go. <laughs> okay, leave you all to it. We're going to carry on chatting. <laughs>
nice little tent and that's what we're all sleeping tonight Good morning. Nice and cold morning here. Great day yesterday. I just saw caught up with a few guys, one heading from north to south on a bit of a track doing an end to end. And two guys heading south to north. They're on their final day of the end to end on the Bilbo track. So they'll be getting into Calamunda sometime, probably about lunchtime. So congratulations to both of you. Yeah. Sitting around at the fire last night, it was beautiful. The tent I was using, the nature I cloud up too. <sighs> Keep me nice and warm, should I say, even though they say it's a four season, but I'd class it as three stroke four season because it's got too much mesh to be a full four season tent. <sighs> but I was comfortable in it, plenty of room for just me and all my gear. <sighs> Yeah, kangaroos are around the tent most of the night. Put their little noses underneath, having a sniff and see what I was up to. Yeah. I'm glad I was in the tent. Uh, I'm not in the shelter, we're doing freezing cold in the shelter. Now I'm heading back to the car now. <coughs> and on my way back, I'm gonna call into the Hikers Hub Cafe on the Bilberman track, which is near where the old camel farm used to be. I'm going to have a nice hot coffee, I am. So, I'll see you all later. We're nearly back at the car. Temperature has warmed up a little bit. So if you're new to my channel, or if you haven't already subscribed, please go, please go down below and click on the subscribe button. Click on the notification bell next to it and select all and click the thumbs up button, the like button and if you are already a subscriber again I thank you very much so until next time get out there, have some fun and take care <laughs>